just a small town boy living in a lonely world. Don't stop believing. It's such a beautiful song, isn't it, George? I mean, think about the places we've heard it. We've heard it on so many roads, all times of the night, going down the road, just me and you. You would talk to me about life, about wrestling, telling me don't stop believing. You were quoting Steve Perry himself. And then things began to change. I went from being like a son to you to being number three. Number three, George. Forget all the times I've slept on your couch. Forget all the times at four o'clock in the morning, me and you riding down a road, singing Steve Perry, singing Don't Stop Believing, The Will in the Sky, and Faithfully. You threw that away January 30th when you called me number three. Number three, George. And the thing is, I thought I was going somewhere in life. Just like any band, I thought, me and you, we was going to ride this wave to the top. You were going to take me somewhere, George. That is exactly what I was thinking. And then when I hit, uh, hit a plateau, I went to looking around and I realized it was just the wind blowing. The scenery hadn't changed. I was still in park. I hadn't gone nowhere. And why is that, George? Maybe it wasn't me. Maybe it was the band. Maybe I was just like Steve Perry. Maybe I hit my plateau and too long I was hanging in there faithfully. But you know what happens, George? Here's what happens. February 27th. In high point. Your own personal Steve Perry himself. Baron Bullard. is going to face the band. He's taking on you and Zane Dawson. And George, February 27th, the wheels in the sky is going to quit turning for you.